What is up guys? So, exciting news today, because there has been an announcement for a new Borderlands game, which I fucking love Borderlands. So, let's see what the fuck it is. So, what I'm hearing reports is that it's an, an they're calling it a prequel, but it, what it actually is an in-between between Borderlands 1 and Borderlands 2, sort of the rise of Handsome Jack. And the coolest shit is, is that you'll be able to choose one of four characters Athena the Gladiator, Wilhelm the Enforcer, Nisha, Nishi, Nishi the Lawbringer, and Frag Trap. Frag Trap, which is a combat ready version of Claptrap. Fucking nasty. Now, Athena is, I believe, is the one from the T Boy Injunction DLC. Um. Wilhelm, the Enforcer, is obviously the person you fight in Borderlands 2. Nisha or Nasha, the Lawbringer, I'm pretty sure is the Sheriff. I don't know if I remember correctly. I don't remember what the fuck her name is. Um, and then Frag Trap. The last one gets me super excited. That's fucking sweet. Imagine being like Claptrap. That's just, I don't know, that's just really fucking cool. So, the whole premise is these are Handsome Jack's lieutenants. And... You get to kind of follow him as he's making a name for himself and shit. So what's going to happen is that all this shit is supposed to take place on Pandora's moon, Elipis. Elipai, fucking weird ass name. And the Hyperion moon base. Which is cool because everything in Borderlands 2 was always in the background was the moon base, the moon base, the moon base. Even in the last Tiny Tina DLC, they're like, hey guys, you know you just got done playing this DLC. Do you want to go fucking blow up a moon base that you won't be able to see at all so i don't know what the fuck they're gonna do with that but uh new weapons a freezing cryo or yeah whatever class is reported to be uh introduced with low gravity on the moon means you have a jet pack to get around hopefully that's not as hopefully that doesn't like i don't know you kind of have a jet pack anyways because you jump like 18 feet in the air but, uh, and then you gotta, like, find oxygen by looting a bunch of shit, anyway. But, the thing is, it's, it's not, like, Borderlands 3. Which, I would be fucking pissed if this was considered Borderlands 3. But, it's supposed to come out later this year for the PC and Xbox and, and uh, PS3. But, uh, a next-gen Gearbox title is expected to be announced, apparently, this year. But... They said it's not going to be Borderlands 3, which is kind of lame. And it makes sense, because Gearbox needs to get their fucking shit together when it comes to their franchises, because they have Borderlands, and that's essentially it. You know what I mean? Which I love Borderlands. But uh, it's not, Gearbox isn't developing this game. It's uh, somebody from 2K Australia, I believe, uh, is actually developing it. So hopefully Gearbox is overseeing it, because when other developers get you know, hands on somebody else's light since there's potential to fuck it up. But I'm just excited about Frag Trap, dude. That sounds cool. Uh, Wilhelm, I'm, I'm, I don't know if he's gonna have, like, his fucking half, like, robot body. Because if he does, he's gonna be, like, 18 feet fucking tall. Um, but, yeah. I don't know. I'm really excited for this game. And I just bought Borderlands 2 on the PC, if you saw my last video. So, I'm definitely going to get on the PC, because uh, I fucking love this game. So, tell me what you guys think about this new Borderlands uh, game coming. I'm fucking excited about it, but, you know, it, it could come out in f December 20th, for all we know. It just says that they're releasing it this year, so who the fuck knows what that means. So, tell me what you guys think of the new Borderlands game, and hope you guys enjoyed the video. You guys have a good one. I am out.